For the past month, me and my family have been on a cross-country road trip. We started in Virginia, and so far we've stopped in Georgia, Alabama, Louisiana, and Texas. And now we're making our way to our next stop. Our next stop is actually one of my favorite places that I've ever visited. Even though initially I expected it to be a place that I didn't think I was really going to like because it is filled with sand. This was actually the first national park we went to on this trip and it is in New Mexico. If you don't know where it is by now, it is Las Cruces, New Mexico, specifically White Sands National Park. that it was going to be very busy because I've seen photos of it before and it always looks so pretty and I think it's just a very cool landscape so I obviously thought that a lot of people were going to be there but as soon as we got there I could not have been more surprised it actually was so empty. number of reasons why not that many people go to White Sands National Park and that's not to say that no one goes because a lot of people definitely go. 782,469 people visited last year in 2021. Now you're thinking, I mean, that's a lot of people going to visit a national park, but a lot of people visit national parks in general and the most visited national park was Great Smoky Mountains, which had 14.1 million people visit, so comparatively, not that many people <laughs> went to White Sands National Park. Out of the 63 national parks, it is the 31st most visited. After going and seeing it, I definitely thought it would be a lot higher. Here we are. Overall, I would say that it is definitely worth going to visit, even though it is not one of the most popular national parks. I think it is definitely a place that I would recommend going. Well, some national parks can be very packed, and this just happens to be one that is not super packed, even though it does get a decent amount of people visiting every year. And I think because it is one of the newer national parks that over time it will become more popular. But for now, I would say it's definitely a good spot to visit in probably one of the most underrated national parks in my opinion. White Sands is actually one of two national parks that we visited on this road trip. So if you are interested to see what the next national park is, it will actually be in my next video. So feel free to stick along and figure out where 
The next national park is on this crazy road trip. Thanks for watching this video. I really do appreciate it and I hope to see you in my next video. I have a lot of sand in my shoes. Oh! Going off riding. Where's my awesome roading? Roading. <laughs> <laughs> We're going off roading. Yeah. I've only dropped my camera about five times today. So hopefully it still works. Begin